Good afternoon to all. Uh, I'm speaking again. I will present in Picasa. This is the Agro Food Technological Center. It's a new technological center. We have just started in January of this year. It's an investment of about three and a half million of euros. And uh, we are based about 140 kilometers from here, just in the interior center of Portugal, near the border with Spain. This is, this is the, the building where we are based. And in this building is also based in Offbuster, which means this is a, a joint strategy that we have set up. Strategy is uh, mainly from the city council and also with support of the Polytechnic Institute of the Salabranco. And this, this building is, is brand new and is uh, located on the industrial area of uh, Castelo Branco. The, 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 the objectives of this uh, Agrofood Technological Center are mainly three. I, I can speak about the applied research uh, in function of the needs of the companies that they search it, and we try to, to do applied research. The other objective is uh, uh, innovation and development of new products. Uh, we, are, we, have started, we have started in January and we are already in, in, in order to develop four products in different areas from olive oil and also from the cheese, and also from yogurt and also from honey. We are in, in working with some companies that have uh, uh, searched us for developing all these new products. And the, the goal is we have a huge capacity, uh, analytical capacity, and of course we also uh, do some services for the, for the companies that are our associates. Since the office is also based in here, and we have about 117 associates, the associates also search for help with their quality of their products, for development of new ideas, and we are there working together with the Agrofood Technological Center and also the, the cluster. We have the three, we have two laboratory units. On the first floor, we have about 2,500 square meters, and in the first floor, we have three laboratories, three main laboratories. We have a microbiology laboratory, we have a, a physical chemical laboratory, and we have a sensory analysis laboratory. This sensory analysis uh, laboratory is um, according to international uh, rules, and uh, we have 10 independent cabins, and we are in order to implement uh, a panel for cheese. Uh, we have a very, very famous cheese, is um, the cheese of Castel Branco. Well, I, I think there are two most famous cheese in Portugal, the Serra da Estrela, there are other ones, of course, uh, and Castelo Branco as well. And uh, we are in, in, in order to, to implement this, um, this panel for, for taste uh, cheese, and also another panel for honey, and also another panel for olive oil. As for, we are very well equipped. Uh, here is the laboratory with the liquid chromatography. And we, are, we have equipment, I just can mm, mm, some of them, the LCMS, the GPLC, UVV, STIRS, ionic chromatography, and we can do whatever sugar characterization, amino acids, uh, contaminants, pesticides, antibiotics, toxins, which means that we are very well equipped to perform all these analyses. This is grass chromatography laboratory. We have also GCMS and GC feeds with different sensors. And we, we are working already with multiple characterization. Fatty acids in fish and meat. Mainly we are characterization, we have, we have a project now, is, uh, we have started a few months ago, about the characterization of some of our traditional uh, fish in our rivers, in, in interior rivers. Not fishes from the oceans, but fishes from the rivers. And also pesticides. This is the, the, the atomic absorption spectrometry laboratory. With, uh, we have also an ICPOS that we can perform metal determinations in water, vegetables, foliar analysis, foods, concentrates, salts, soils, soils in cooperation with um, the School of Agriculture of the Polytechnic Institute of Castelo Branco. The microbiology laboratory is it, very well equipped as well. We have, uh, we have um, done a bet in to give answers very fast which means we have implemented fast methods analysis and uh, in order to, 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 to give answers to the companies as fast as possible. Of course, that we have also implemented the traditional the microbiology uh, evaluation. Some of the equipment uh, we have benefited for pathogenic uh, research for some analysis areas. 
Uh, everybody knows the problems of the foods, especially with the cheese and the meat. And also for the tempo, this is the quality indicators. Uh, and also here we can have special gold as an example, cephalocode, gender of factory acid. This is give us very fast uh, answers. We take, here we can have we have um, a database and we can identify uh, gram positives, gram negatives and also uh, yeasts. As for the other unit that is in, in, in the paper below, we have identified four main areas and uh, we call them pilot units. These pilot units we have identified four of them. This is for meat, dairy, olive oil and horticulture. As for the dairy, so we, we have set up a laboratory mainly for support to cheese manufacturing processes for our, our dog, our uh, denomination of origin, of protected denomination of origin products. And we are working a lot with, uh, with companies. I can tell you that in the North Cluster we have now 13 companies that, uh, the major companies that produce the cacao branco uh, chips are associated from the North Cluster and they are working with us in some projects as well. As for the olive oil, it's already working now. We have an uh, um, olive oil processing unit and we have already started last year, last in November, uh, with the two companies trying to, to create new products and this year we have already two or three ideas for new products as well. As for the horticulture, uh, what we want to, 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 to work mainly is on post harvest. <coughs> mainly we will build up some papers for uh, modified atmospheres and with some gas. But uh, this is under is not yet implemented. Especially the horticulture and the meat is not yet implemented, but uh, is on the second stage. I hope that with the dry we can still uh, finish it this uh, this uh, this project. Well, this is our, our unit. The, the, the dairy product is already working. The olive oil unit is also working. Only the horticulture products and the meat products, as for the pilot, pilot the, for the pilot plants, are not working for the moment. Uh, we are involved in some other projects. Some of them are international, special involving cherries, watermelons, cheese projects as well, uh, and it, it, it as international projects. As for the products, as I said before, uh, we have also some uh, some four projects that uh, uh, we have started just since January because this is a brand new project and we have only about six months of work, but we are in cooperating with people and with the institutions. This is a, a joint project from the local city council and also from the Polytechnic Institute, but is also involved in the project that I spoke in the morning, some of the other uh, anchor projects from the cluster, the Polytechnic and the CATA, they are involved on those projects. Thank you very much.